Hey dinosaurs! So today I'm filming a video all about what I got on dresslink.com and a bunch of other information about the website and my personal opinions on the website. So I'm going to show you guys all the stuff I bought and what it looks like on. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys will enjoy the video. So I'm going to read you guys a few quick things about the website off of my phone right here and just give you guys an idea of what it'll be like if you guys buy from dresslink.com. So I ordered on September 26th at 12 o'clock right after watching Trisha Paytas' unboxing video. Um, it took them three days to pack the boxes and it should take 7 to 19 business days to ship to me. Um, I chose like the cheapest shipping which was China Post Airmail, but I chose like the cheapest shipping that had um, a tracking number just in case my order got lost I could still get like my money back. So, um, my tracking number, I got it early, so I got it on September 30th, but I should have got it on October 1st or 2nd, so they're really good with their shipping, like their tracking numbers, they get them out really fast. Um, I got half of my package, like, or a third of my package, and I didn't know that it was coming in three packages. They never told me that they were sending my packages by weight, so when I only got one package, like, really early on October 15th, I was freaking out because I was like, they only gave me three things and I bought 12 items. What's going on? So they should probably inform their customers if they're going to send their stuff in, like, separate packages, but whatever. Um, so I got my first package on October 15th and my second package on October 22nd, which was before October 25th, which was the last day that it should have arrived. So it did come early, earlier than it like could have been, but it wasn't like right away. But I didn't choose the fastest shipping, so I didn't expect it to come right away. I am also, when I only got a third of my package, um, I freaked out because I was like, did I just pay $107 for 12 items and got three? So I emailed them at night and then the next morning when I woke up and checked my email, they emailed me back. So their customer service is really, really good. Um, so that's like a really big plus about the website. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is three pairs of leggings I bought. Um, the only problem with these leggings, sorry, I left everything in its super loud packaging. But the only problem with these leggings is that they're a little too small, but there's they're only like one size fits all, but they totally didn't fit me. So what I have to do is I'm going to have to alter these to like cut off the top and then like extend it so it'll like fit my body properly. Um, if you guys want a video on how I'm going to fix these pants, make sure to comment down below because I'll totally film a video on me like fixing them to make them my size. So yeah, um, I'm going to show you what they look like. I'm going to take everything out of its like really loud packaging right now. But first I'm just going to show you what the packaging looks like. So they come in like this, with like this obnoxious packaging. And then they come all inside of one big package that looks like this. It's like a giant package plastic bag. So I got these leggings. They're a really cute print. But unfortunately, when I ordered these leggings, I ordered a different pair. Like, they're in a different color, but um, they messed up with all three leggings. Like, I bought other leggings that weren't in, like, this Christmas pattern. But for all of the leggings that were in the Christmas pattern, they ended up getting confused, I guess. Or maybe I just didn't write down the right number or something. But something got lost in translation, but I'm not going to ship them back, mainly because if you ship them back, you have to pay for the shipping. So... I'm just going to keep these even though they weren't exactly what I wanted. They're not ugly or anything. Another thing I got is this really cute cat sweater. It's like adorable. And it has like little rips at the bottom and little rips in the sleeves. And basically I really like this sweater. It looks really cute on me. The only problem is this one sweater has like a really weird smell on it. Yeah, like it smells really gross. I don't know why. But it has a really bad smell, so before I'd ever wear this sweater out, um, I'll have to like wash it first because it smells really weird. I don't know why. So the next thing I got are leggings that have little bows going down the front, and they're really cute. Um, they're really cute. They have like little bows. I only have a few more things to show you because honestly, I didn't buy that much off the website. But I got this dress, which is like a polka dot dress. It's really cute. It's like this. It's a really cute dress. I like the way it fits me. I like the way it flares out at the bottom. Um, obviously, right now it's kind of cool to wear dresses, but um, I think if I had like a more formal occasion that was indoors, it would be really cute for it. And then I got this sweater, which has like um, 
lace on the back and then it says like rainbow sweetly on the front and then I got these floral leggings which are really cute I like the way they look they fit me well then I got this shirt which is really hard to see on camera and then I got this jacket that I actually really like and it's like cheetah print on the inside and it like closes like it folds over itself it looks really cute and I like the way it fits it's a little tight on my arms um, but it's mostly because all of these are made really really small so when buying stuff again just buy a size up these shoes which looked a lot cuter on their website um, I was really actually disappointed with their shoe quality like if you look here there's like this thing sticking out of their shoe so it wasn't so properly closed on the end and then like um, in the box was completely crushed when they shipped it so like the shoes were like absolutely demolished like they're like squished in I don't know I don't really like the way they ship these I feel like if they were shipped properly they would look a lot better now but I guess if you pay seven dollars and then you don't want to spend extra money on shipping that's what you get but I don't know I would recommend you guys don't buy their shoes from their website mostly because they don't really they don't really treat them that well like look how squished they are they're like squished I don't know and then the, the fur makes them look kind of cheap I'm thinking maybe I can make the tr the fur look better if I like fluff it out a bunch and like try to get the fur to be all poofy and stuff and then like put like something in here to like stretch it out try and fix the shoes but I don't know what to do leave comments down below if you guys know what I should do to fix these I think dresslink.com is a really cool website to check out if you guys are on a budget and you want to just buy some cute clothes um it's a really cool website and everything's really cheap and I'll totally link it down below I'm not like sponsored by them or anything it's not like a referral link I don't even think dresslink.com does that but they are a really cool website and I totally would recommend you guys check them out because they are really cool. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Bye. Rawr.